I welcome everyone to our YouTube channel AEO Grey Organics. In this video we will see the important problems and the verification status faced by our uh, subscribers. If you are new to our channel you can subscribe our channel. Our channel is the only channel to give ISER counseling and agriculture education related videos in English since 2021. So you can share our channel with your friends also. It will be very useful for ISER counseling. So here uh, in this video we will see the clear explanation for uh, the problems uh, the candidates that they faced and uh, you can also get awareness uh, through these problems uh, and you can suggest it to your juniors so this is very very important okay you have to suggest uh, it to your juniors to for the selection of the subject uh, or getting the certificate everything this is not only for this this video is especially for your juniors of the upcoming batches okay because last year also we have uploaded similar videos but none of them shared you so you are suffering now if you are not sharing with your juniors then they will suffer then th that suffering will be continuously going on so as per my knowledge as per our idea this has to be stopped at one end so we are uh, giving this video so this video will be very useful to all of you here uh, this is the first thing admission verification status verified okay it is found at only one place but in most of our videos as in the previous video we have shown here will be another one line verification remark it will also be verified so some have asked the doubt we have found only this one verification whether it is okay or we need to get the two verification also if you are getting this one verified it is enough no need to go for uh, no need to do any other thing and here there will be the option for fees payment and admission payment you can do the payment and you can go for further step as we mentioned in our previous video okay this is the information next the second thing is we will see the problems from here we are going to see the problem okay here the verification admission status verified subject to additional documents okay this is not a problem here is the verification remark so in the verification remark the first verification remark is upload accreditation certificate of university from which they completed ug so ug means they have come from where they have completed bs agriculture they want ICER accreditation certificate okay they are telling to upload so they can upload here the second point is upload proof of your entrance examination for admission to the UG degree program okay how you have joined your UG for that you have to give the proof okay admit card or the result or submit a certificate from the dean registrar or controller of examinations of your college or university confirming that you were admitted through JET national level cute or state level entrance examination in UG program okay actually this student yesterday called me and for that student from that particular university they called that student also and they asked how you joined UG they told based on 12th mark okay through counseling and they told then if you have joined it through based on 12th mark you are not eligible for doing MSc in our college okay you see how that particular university rules us okay they mentioned like if you have joined your ug through 12th mark you are not eligible for doing msc at our university because at our in for joining msc at our university you, you should have joined, joined your ug through either of these cute programs or any other entrance examination test only but that student told as i am from tamil nadu in our state there is no entrance examination for any of the UG courses okay and even for joining MBBS also based on the compulsion by central government only we are uh, following this need otherwise we will not be following any entrance examination because we are doing all the admission based on 12th mark only okay but uh, this particular university is uh, telling no it is uh, as per our university rules you are not eligible so then in the verification remark they have mentioned like uh, this one okay you have to upload the certificate that uh, how you have joined your ug so but uh, you see how the rules of this university is because uh, this is a problem why they want for uh, joining msc why they want uh, how they have joined uh, ug okay this is not a problem at all you see we are facing this problem for the first time if you are giving this particular university in the choice filling in the upcoming years you have to stop this one so this particular university is Jodhpur University in Rajasthan. This is not a problem itself. Just this uh, candidate asked me uh, this doubt. So I am sharing here. If your upgradation, your uh, admission seat or admission, you will be ineligible for uh, campus or course freeze in future on. Actually, this itself is meaningless. But uh, here I am telling the meaning of this. If you are doing upgradation, you will be ineligible for uh, the course that you have been already allotted to and the college you have been allotted to in the future ones okay i hope you will be understanding that so whatever the course or the university you have been allotted in the first round you are ineligible for that so in the upcoming rounds so until uh, but until and unless you are allotted a new college in the upcoming round so that uh, seat will be uh, hold for you so that uh, everyone will be knowing but i am just i am explaining here also next uh, this is important thing Verified uh, subject to additional documents. Verification remark is submit the PDC within stipulated time. So 
within tomorrow 12 noon they have to submit the pdc because most of the students have not yet submitted the pdc and this problem is very very important problem you have to tell your juniors compulsorily they have rejected the admission okay verification remark is minimum ogp of 7.5 or 75 percentage of the mark is needed at the msc agriculture level so this is for phd so for joining the phd they should have got a msc ogp of 7.5 or above okay but this student have got ogp of 7.4 so they have rejected and uh, but this is as per the university rules only not according to isa rules so as per isa rules in for 10 ogp scale so here they have mentioned for uh, srf only so for uh, general obc ews and uh, ups 6.5 ogp is should be maintained in msc okay and for sc st pwbd and third gender 5.5 ogp has to be maintained okay that is they mentioned but according to the university rules the university has rejected i don't know which is this university next is uh, this verified this we have seen already next is uh, verified subject to additional documents pdc from the register need to be uploaded okay this is uh, one thing uh, in some of the universities uh, especially in universities uh, in Anomaly University, controller of examination will be signing this PDC or some other university, some assistant registrar or a controller of examination or any other authority may be signing this PDC. But uh, some universities need PDC that it should be signed by registrar of that university only. So like that uh, they have asked and this candidate need to be uploaded this, uh, uploaded this PDC from the registrar, not from any other authority. Okay, here uh, verified subject to additional documents kindly upload valid domicile certificate okay we have uploaded more than 10 videos for this since 2021 okay we have explained what is meant by domicile certificate what is meant by nativity certificate what is meant by residential certificate even last uh, two weeks before also we have uploaded three videos related to that okay so in this uh, if you are um, uploading if they are asking domicile certificate or nativity certificate both are same okay that it indicates where you belong to which is village which place you are belonging to but this third is the residential certificate so, so the residential certificate means uh, where you are staying okay today i will be staying in pg hostel of darwat tomorrow i will be staying at my native okay so it will vary na so from today it will be different tomorrow it will be different so that is the residence okay where you are staying so in order to upload this you want the nativity certificate only not the residential certificate so for uploading this you want to get either nativity certificate or domicile certificate not the residential certificate so this also we mentioned in many of our videos next is please provide professional degree certificate for admission so many students have not uploaded pdc so they are uploading the pdc they may have uploaded only up to seventh semester mark sheet for uh, msc admission and the third semester mark sheet for phd admission so they are uh, get asking the pdc for admission okay otherwise they can upload the course completion certificate also next is verified document verified and found eligible for provisional admission verification of the original documents at the reporting to the university so they have mentioned this remark as uh, you have to give the all the documents for verification at the time of physical reporting there is no problem in this so they can direct go for this admission payment there is no problem subject to additional document please re-upload your original pdc of last pg degree okay they are asking the pdc or upload a final original final submission certificate of last degree actually this is for a phd candidate so they have not yet uh, completed their viva was in their course completion certificate they have not mentioned like viva was has been completed okay they have mentioned it in different form okay so for that only they are asking that the certificate that is course completion certificate in that they should have mentioned that original viva, final viva was has been completed okay that is they are asking so this also need to be taken care if uh, i think so this year many students are facing this problem because they not yet completed uh, their msc and even some university at la last uh, very late they completed their bsc ug program also so in the upcoming years you should insist your juniors to complete uh, their ug or msc program at the earliest to join in the next degree program otherwise they will suffer a more problem more than what you are uh, facing now okay this one has to be inform to your juniors also i think so no one will inform because uh, i informed the same thing to your previous batch also they did not inform you so you are facing this problem now i am informing to you also you should inform your juniors otherwise uh, they will also face a problem and this uh, facing the problem will be going on continuously it will be like a cycle only next is uh, gap certificate at the time of admission so gap certificate means uh, for example a student has completed uh, their ug uh, two years before okay for the two years after two years now they have applied for pg and they are doing their pg now okay their admission now so two years what they did so that is uh, in the during that gap period what they did they have to get a certificate from this you can get from your previous allotted in previous studied university or you can get from the judiciary stamp like that so we will upload a, a separate video or we will inform in the community tab how to get that gap certificate okay next is a verified subject to additional document 
ப்ளீஸ் அப்லோட் பிடிசி ஆஃப் லாஸ்ட் அட்டர் யூனிவர்சிட்டி பிஎஸ்சி டிகிரி பிடிசி ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் நார்மல் ப்ராப்ளம் ஒன்லி ஆஸ் யூஷுவல் தே ஹவ் ஆல்சோ ஆஸ்கர் நெக்ஸ்ட் இஸ் ஜாப் சர்டிஃபிகேட் அட் த டைம் ஆஃப் அட்மிஷன் திஸ் இஸ் வெரிஃபைட் திஸ் இஸ் வெரிஃபைட் திஸ் இஸ் ஆல்சோ வெரிஃபைட் ஆக்சுவலி இன் திஸ் தெர் இஸ் அ ப்ராப்ளம் த அட்மிஷன் ஹஸ் பின் ரிஜெக்டட் ஓகே தே ஹவ் மென்ஷன் த ரீசன் இஸ் பிஎஸ்சி ஹான்ஸ் அக்ரிகல்ச்சர் இஸ் நாட் எலிஜிபிள் ஃபார் எம்டெக் ஃபுட் ப்ராசஸிங் டெக்னாலஜி ஓகே அட் ஃபேக்கல்ட்டி ஆஃப் அக்ரிகல்ச்சர் பனாரஸ் இந்து யூனிவர்சிட்டி ஓகே தீஸ் ஸ்டூடெண்ட் ஹவ் கம்ப்ளீட்டட் பிஎஸ்சி ஹான்ஸ் ஹார்ட் அக்ரிகல்ச்சர் ஓகே ஆக்சுவலி தேர் வர் டூ ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் லைக் திஸ் ஐ காட் ஓன்லி ஒன் ஸ்க்ரீன் ஷாட் தேர் வர் டூ ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் தே போத் அவர் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் தே போத் ப்ரிப்பேர் டுகெதர் ஃபார் திஸ் ஃபுட் ப்ராசஸிங் டெக்னாலஜி பட் அட் த டைம் ஆஃப் சாய்ஸ் ஃபில்லிங் தே ஹவ் கிவன் பிஹெச் யூ இன் டாப் ஓகே தே ஹவ் பின் போத் வேர் அலர்ட் டு பிஹெச் ஓன்லி போத் அட்மிஷன் ஹஸ் பின் ரிஜெக்டட் பை மென்ஷனிங் தட் அக்கார்டிங் டு த யூனிவர்சிட்டி ரூல்ஸ் தே ஆர் நாட் எலிஜிபிள் டு ஸ்டடி at uh, if they are from bsc agriculture background but uh, as per icr as they have mentioned in that icr counseling brochure uh, or icr information bulletin in that it is mentioned that bsc agriculture is eligible for studying this food processing technology so every student should be very clear that uh, they have completed their whether they have completed their eligibility degree for studying in that particular for or for doing post graduation in that particular degree so they have to be very careful about that while selecting the subject and um, it should be very very they should be careful so uh, this is one problem and another one problem is like um, uhs bagalkot they are also rejecting that particular candidate and another one candidate uh, yesterday he told me um, that uh, some university i think so bikaner in uh, rajasthan they rejected uh, that candidate because uh, he is uh, doing application for msc entomology okay but he did uh, see article sir from uhs bagalkot now they are mentioning like uh, you are not eligible for entomology you can do only degrees like vegetable science fruit science like that but uh, we know hundreds of students uh, those who are uh, from article sir background and they are doing uh, subjects like uh, soil science or entomology plant pathology like that so these are the problems faced by the students so at the time of choice filling sure the students should be taken care about the university they have to go through all the eligibility criteria of all the university or icr should mentioned clearly in that but icr have generally made one statement only students are responsible for that and they have to go through the individual brochure of individual university but it is very difficult for the student to go through within the two days time of choice filling but everything should be taken care and it is left to the student